Hello and welcome to this Dr Frost video on determining a cost involving the circumference of a full circle. Let's read the question. Omar's labelling a wooden barrel in the shape of a cylinder. So you've got your cylinder here and the radius of the kind of circular top of the cylinder of this barrel is 1.7 metres. Remember the radius is the line from the centre of the circle to the edge, the circumference of the circle. Omar wants to put a label around the edge of the barrel. The label costs $2.99 per metre of length. Work out the total cost of the label. Now we firstly need to find the total length of the label because we're being charged per metre of length. Now to find the length of this label, that would just be the circumference of this circle, the total length around the outside of this circle that goes around the barrel. And remember how we find the circumference of a circle? If we know the radius of the circle, or we know the diameter, which is the length from one end of the circle to the opposite end. Remember the diameter is just two times the radius because you've got radius, radius, two lots of radius is the diameter. The circumference or the perimeter of the circle is either pi times the diameter, so pi d, or it's two pi r, where r is the radius. Now in this case, we've got the radius of the circle, it's 1.7, so we're gonna use this formula here. So the circumference of the circle, or the length of the label in this case, the length of the label, which is the circumference of the circle, all the way around the edge of the barrel, that's two times pi times r. Remember in algebra, when we have things next to each other, it just means you times them together. So it's two times pi times r. So two times pi times r, where r is the radius of the barrel, 1.7. Now, if I do that on my calculator, so two, times shift pi times by 1.7, it's 10.681, uh, and what's the unit? Meters. You may have to press up the SD key to convert it to a decimal or something like that. Um, so that's the length of the label, and we're told we're being charged $2.99 for each meter of length. So we just need to times those two numbers together. So the cost, will be that length multiplied by the rate, what you're paying for each meter of length, so $2.99. And if I do that on my calculator, I'm just gonna use that 10.681 directly from my calculator. So I just need to press a times key and then 2.99 and then equals, and I get 31.94 and that will be in dollars. So it's $31.94 and that is the final answer.